I want rocket boots. Where is the goblin army? I have. Heck, I'll give you half as well. I get that. I get that. We just filling this up. Yeah, we're just filling this up with mud, pretty much. All the way up we to like, have, the dirt walls. We don't have to though. I just dug down because I was trying to make cover try and build my way up under because I was being bombarded by tons of enemies at once. So oh, there's a to go all the way to top. Just camp. I just dashed on accident. Oh, no. Oh, see what I mean? It's, it's not just the zombies. The slimes do the spawn into this. We exist. You just keep the torches there. That's funny. And that'll wow, grow just let time. it grow. Just see if grow. Oh, that's a lot of curbos, and I like it. <laughs> I'm gonna let do this grow. because this I think does I wanna... help with the generation of the biome. Okay, yeah, I was thinking this wasn't um, big enough. Since I still have seeds, I was thinking of expanding it. So what you can do is kind of make like empty zones like this, and then just the seeds will expand to it, and then it'll count as more mushroom blocks. Uh, okay. Without compromising the space, I accidentally just dashed and placed them in a lot of the wrong places. It'll also allow mushrooms to grow. I was also gonna make a house made of mushrooms for the truffle once we get that. Uh, that'll be fine for now, probably. So we're gonna go fight the giant clam, you say? That is on the agenda. Okay, um, can you suggest health, health, by by how I can move quick in the water? Uh, have I you made extreme. big pet armor yet? I have not. I do, don't would... even know what that even is. So, Vic Ted armor is a, an armor set that allows you to move faster in water. This has a bunch of water buffs. Um, oh, so it's sea remains. So it's like the Neptune shell. Do we have? Yeah, we do. I can make you a set. Probably. If you want to. Why not? Do you have a fishbone boomerang, by the way, or no? A fishbone. Let's see. Fishbone. Boomerang. I got a rotten dog tooth. I don't know where I got my hands on that. Doesn't look like I have a fish bone. I have a hook. Yeah, I don't have a fish bone. Oh, what'd you give me? A ah. fish bone boomerang. Ooh. Well, thank you. I'll try it then. Uh, here. I can't say it's better than your current armor, but it's good for the specific fight. Yeah, that's what I was thinking anyway. Dead crab, huh? Here, head crab. Alright, well, it's been equipped. I think I see the Eye of Cthulhu, like, flying around in the distance in the background. Yeah. Yeah, he does that sometimes. He's what a cool guy, am I right, guys? Mm, yep. What a cool guy. Miss him already. What's this do? Ah, uh, yes, a blood moon. My a favorite. blood moon. Oh, oh no. wow, a blood zombie spawned inside the house. Wow, crazy. That's crazy. That's a lot of piranhas. Oh, crap. A blood moon. Oh, he's gonna go farm and, yeah. uh... And Andy definitely yeah, triggered that. Spawned it. <laughs> I'm just gonna stay inside because I'm not I'm gonna fight them in the arena. And by fight them, I mean stand completely still. Because, ah, uh, yeah. Summoner life. No! <laughs> I summoned it right at the end of the day. <laughs> I do not know what I'm okay. seeing right now. There's like a. There is a moray eel that I guess is stuck in like the floor of the house. It's like. It's like popping up from the floor and then like just disappearing and then like I, I don't know what I'm seeing. Oh, the ocean pillar, the, the ocean pylon doesn't work. It worked last I checked. Uh, did somebody die? Oh, oh yeah. yeah, a slime definitely died while someone was there. The slime and the merchant. Oh, and the merchant. Okay. 
Okay, there you go. Now it works. Hey, what's going on, guys? Are you guys seeing this eel popping out of the floor? I do, actually. Oh. <laughs> Ow! Oh, there you go, it's dead now. I remember back in the day when NPCs couldn't defend themselves. Mm, yep, yeah, me too. Some say they still can't. Pretty much. Basically. Like me. I do know there's certain tomes, like books, you can find that increase their stats, but barely. Oh, there are? Yeah, I think I found one of them. Actually, I got it from a shimmer biome. What do we... Yes, that is one of them. The other one is like fished during a blood moon. Which oh. It's like an extremely rare drop. So we headed down to that oasis area. Oh yeah, like we need to giant the crab, clam. The clam. Yeah. I'm uh, more confident that's... now. That I have a bit a set of armor for it and a necklace for it. That still sucks to fight. I bet, but at least I have a chance now. Does armor penetration work on summons? I don't even remember. I know knockback doesn't. Is it? So being a summoner is like the damage rating in the game, but you also have the lowest defense imaginable. Like, nope, you have the lowest damage output and the lowest defense. Oh, that's not how I see it. You're in that's not how I see <laughs> I'm, it. I I'm see incredibly it. strong as a summoner. Yeah, dude. In it's normal kind of vanilla summon. Okay, yeah, okay, it might be In terms of calamity, here, yes. It. Here, like, vanilla, Magic has the highest DPS output. Like, being a mage in video games in general is just super broken. But you do die to one hit, though. Yeah, like Baldur's Gate, for example. Like, the wizard has, like, being a wizard has, like, the lowest hit points in the game. But you have ridiculous damage output when casting spells. Shadow Wizard Money Gang, we love casting spells. We got young Leviosa. Alright, wait, where'd you guys vanish to? Uh, I am in the desert. I, uh, will teleport to you then. Oh, you're in the underground desert. This. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, uh, yeah, you. that place sucks. The underground uh, desert in general is ruthless. Alright, and Big Ted Arvin's going on. Uh, I need to take off that. That's not gonna work down here. Hermes boots aren't gonna work down here either. Not really, at least. Anyways, you were, you were talking about a vanilla summoner having weak damage, right? Yeah. Uh, I I'm was surprised talking... you think that, because when I'm playing summoner in vanilla, I feel really strong. I agree with you. I think being a summoner in a vanilla game has the highest damage output. Well, from extensive testing, no. <laughs> Just, unfortunately, not really. Weird. Yeah, I mean, I still feel really powerful. Uh, like, even, like, 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 you know how you feel pretty weak once hard mode begins. I, mm -hmm. I've never felt that way as a summoner. That's because as a summoner you can hide back most of the time. No, I mean, like, I'm, like, in caves and stuff alone, and I feel like I kill things pretty effectively. I don't know. I've never had the problem of hard mode uh, power loss with any class, really. <laughs> I do. I do every time. It's like you're back to square one, as if you're starting over in the game, you know? I remember when we were first playing Master, I felt so weak at the beginning of hard mode. But yeah, I mean, it's also master mode, it's supposed when, to be when, uh, really difficult. Yeah, yeah, when we were playing our master save a long time ago. I ago. forgot to bring wood. Or platforms, whatever. But when I was playing a uh, master as a summoner with uh, my friend a long time ago, I, I felt, like, really powerful. And I continued feeling that way, like, forever. Hmm. I don't know. 
Anyways, we're both in the underground uh, ocean. Giant clams over there. Oh, a party girl. Oh, that's gonna get some getting used to with this weapon. There's a pause before throwing it. Yark. We have the giant clam here if you guys aren't busy. I'll be there in a bit. Have you triggered it yet or no? No. All right, I am coming. Bass defense. How do I get a Kerbo? Uh, I believe it's wood and gems. Ah, okay. Interesting combination. Should we also, extend the platform more, more to the... I it's... don't have anything to extend it with. Okay. I always keep wood on me. What are the Kerbo things called? It is... They're called Star Crosses. Oh. Right, I forgot we can search oh, with the recipe browser. I need meteorite bars to make a summon weapon with them. Oh yeah, I remember looking at it a long time ago and thinking, oh, well, you guys are gonna have to wait for that. But I forgot that I looked at it. <laughs> Whoa, wow, we're actually building an arena, huh? Let's see. Nice. It's jump height is yak. I'm meteorite. Also, are you playing music? Or at least this is your character? I'm wearing headphones. There's uh, an item literally called Soldier in Headphones. You know, it's what's popping off the music notes. Uh, I think I already have that. Probably good enough after you make that last layer time. Yeah, I was thinking I'd leave it in here. Is everyone else gonna be down here? Or is it just gonna be us three fighting this thing? Oh, are we fighting you? Yep. Alright then. I'm coming. Oh, there's your birthday on the 12th. Mine? Yeah. My birthday is on the 27th. Of October? Speaking yep. of which, oh, um, were you wanting something birthday. for your birthday? I was thinking of returning the favor. Uh, a million dollars. <laughs> um... Alright, I'll get it to you. Let me go. <laughs> if you see anything on the news about a bank, don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, I don't know, just pretty much, I guess. I, I, w I would say what are my games for my wish list, but I already have so many games I haven't played yet that I want to yeah, play. Yeah, you have a lot of things on the wait list. <laughs> on the wait list right now. But you get to come over here, Lee? It's the least I can do for what you got me from Do so you get to come over here, Lee? I thought I should um, ask. Water okay. combat? I uh, didn't well, get any I'm, I, and I, Unless you can dedicate I'm, an entire day just to play uh, we'll play online if you prefer that. <laughs> it's all good. Yeah, I, I, I know you. I know you care, and that's that's good enough for me. So well, you, I, I'm asking because I want to. So. Uh, well, yeah. I mean, I guess I guess just <laughs> a game on my wish list. That's really a, you uh, have, the only thing um, I can think of. Do you have the ocean crust, Lee? I have the. I think I have. What do you mean? Yeah, I have an ocean crest. It's a boss item. Everybody came. It comes free with the boss item. <laughs> the pasty spawn. It comes free with the treasure bag. Which treasure bag? The desert scourge treasure bag. Um. The ocean crest is free. It came free with your treasure bag. I guess I'll look for it. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. We're killing him without him noticing. Yeah, I didn't intend to fight with you guys, so... What? <laughs> the clam well, is gone, by the way. I didn't intend to fight with giant clam, but here I am. Yeah, the clam left. I was like, these guys are losers. She'll be back. I think there was another one over here, actually. Well, it's probably just a normal clam. Well, there's a normal clam over here. No, it looks like it despawned. Dang it. Oh, I found the ocean crest. If we have enough sea remains, you could try to make Victide armor, otherwise, your range, you can dodge by just staying really far away, not getting aggro. Yeah. <laughs> just don't get aggro, and you'll be fine. Just don't die. Just don't die, Momo. So, yeah, these statues here, um, in my master mode um, save, 
I just have these everywhere in my arena. Just to make sure. <laughs> Better be properly spaced out. And I just have... Um, I put them all right next to each other to increase the well. defense. <laughs> Yeah, I have the heart lamps like as well, just to make sure, you know, because you could, I could always make go out of range. I would have made heart lamps if uh, we had extra life crystals. I mean, I sure did. <laughs> yeah, you, once, like, if you were to look at my arena, you would see a very big, long arena just full of those statues. And... I'm going to go find a clam to spawn. And if I run around, it'll be like, hey. Hi, what are you doing? Is it possible to make a spawn point here? Uh, maybe out of the water? <laughs> <laughs> you will find a dry area or just dig into the ceiling, maybe? I'm looking to. Oh, oh, I, oh I found one. Found one. Yeah, uh, but it's very far life. away. Or I can hit him and I'll run for my life. Well, there is a. Um... A minecart track above me. If I hit him and just run I, as quick as I can, I should be fine. Yeah, that could work right here. All right, you guys ready? I am ready. All right, let me um, chug down some buff potions before I hit him. I hit him. How many potions do you have? This guy's drinking like seven potions. I need different types of buff potions. I have five potions. I have zero. <laughs> oh! Ah, loser. Ah! <laughs> that sucks to be. Oh, gosh! <laughs> oh, look at me over here getting lost. Good thing the clan didn't come after me. I got lost. I hate that attack. I know. What that sucks. He's targeting me. I would hate me too. Watch out. Don't get hit. He's teleporting on me. I'm gonna go on the left side. Oh, really? Ow, 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 ow. Oh my gosh, of course I got side swapped by that one. That attack doesn't oh, seem hurts. that difficult. It's, like, I, I don't, it's so deceptively difficult. Which one? The, the attacks coming from the sky? Yeah, I mean, when you know what to expect, it doesn't seem like it should be that hard to dodge, and yet it is. Oh, oh my! I it was actually impossible for me to dodge it we where I was. Him. Hey, we killed him. Got him. Oh, oh my dead. Yeah, he literally <laughs> drops like uh, a thing for one person to pick up. Hey, whoever picked up the stuff also just mm -hmm. dropped the rich ones. The white pearl. What? There's no drop. Yeah. There's no bag that he drops. No, he doesn't drop a bag. And am I, Emidius? Emidius? Yep. Yeah, this is. Midas. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know how to say his name. He sells some stuff. Some stuff and things. I just get crabs. Hold on. I'm out of here. Disappears into the world. So what what does do what do we gain from defeating that clan? This yep. guy right here. Is it like Oh, is that a pet? No, it's a guy. It's a dude. So, oh, it's a new NPC. Okay. So the statues and the white pearl, is that all? Is that what you said? I think so. Alright. Should be like the relic and There's a summoner weapon. Yeah, I got both of the summoner weapons. So does he live in a, our, a one of our houses or is he just going to stay yeah, in here? Yeah, he lives, he lives in a house. Alright. I've So I'm assuming he was trapped in the clan? Yes. <laughs> okay, he's been freed from the clan. I don't know how these hermit crabs fight. I need to figure it out. Well, Where is an enemy? Weapons, so that's nice. 
Also, our next fight is a stars of. Or actually, it's Krabby Lawn. Krabby Lawn? I don't know who that is. I take it to him. Ooh, got him. Krabs. Krabs, you're useless! Kill him! Alright, I'm getting these cra my crabs. These crabs suck. <laughs> I'd rather just have my controllers in my eyeball. You are not in it. Material, neither are you. You're not a material up here, neither are you. So, is that boss in the same place we were at, or is it a different area? What boss? Crabulon? Yeah. Crabulon is not. Crabulon is fought somewhere else, uh, in the mushroom biome. Oh, that's why you were there. Really? Yeah, that's why I was crafting. Out of all places on where a crab could be is in a mushroom biome, not like the yeah. ocean. No, he's made out of mushrooms. Interesting. <laughs> we still... <laughs> Let me see Have here. we any crystals in the corruption yet? Uh, oh, the shadow orbs yeah, we're talking shadow about? Orbs. Um, I haven't broken any. I had no if reason to. If we haven't broken any, we can go break two. Wouldn't that, like, increase the chances of the meteorite landing? No. Yep. Or, well, It'll defeating happen. the Eater of Worlds will cause meteors to fall. I think meteors can fall beforehand. I don't believe you. Hold on. Let me search this up. I mean, I'm pretty sure I've seen meteors fall before in either of worlds. Okay. I could I be think stupid, but meteorites can actually land before the Eye of Cthulhu uh, is present. I think you just need to hit two shadow orbs. I think you just need to be lucky. Luckily, yeah, and luckily, um, a meteorite will land. A meteor event can only be triggered once the player has defeated the Eater of Worlds or the Brain of Cthulhu for the first time. Okay, so they changed it. Unless Calamity changed it back. I wouldn't know. Not sure. Eh, don't worry about it. It, 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 it let me see. It's a PC console mobile and team mod loader versions has the criteria that I just said. Everything else is when you break a shadow orb. 3DS, old gen, Windows phone. <laughs> yeah. Oh, what? Could, you can play Terraria on a Windows phone? Is that what I heard? Um, according to the wiki. Wow. Alright, so we're off to the mushroom biome. Yeah. The mushroom. The mushroom biome, that mushroom is very firm. Uh, I would- somebody bring- I want to grab wood, actually. Before I jump down into the abyss. Alright. My sister likely despises the undead rising every night. What about me? As long as they have money, it's a benefit to us, right? So what are, What should I look for to start the fight? I have the summon. The summon oh. is made with um, glowing mushrooms and just glowing mushrooms at a demon altar. Okay, made that a while so ago. You'll... All right, so we just need a demon to get to a demon altar. Also, um, will we I need to have a... For it. Okay. Will we need an arena? Or do we already, already have we one? Oh, we already have already be one. In yeah, the there's already one. Okay. I'm prepared. Well, if I already have my stuff, and I'm ready to go. You don't play Calamity this many times and not make a few arenas, am I right? Heh. <laughs> Heh. Yeah. That might be fine. I guess we'll find out. This is an actual boss fight, so take count to your uh, spawn times. Oh! <laughs> she just disappeared! <laughs> I got taken by the demons. I'm gonna drink this soda. My hair, oh, whoops. I was not at a loop. You're telling me I can't just hammer cobwebs on a workbench and turn it into silk? That's what I do. In real life. <laughs> Call it I good old mash and press. I do it in my dream, so why can't I do it in this game? Alright, so right, I'm saying. Oh, diamonds. 
Oh, it was a sapphire. Why was it shaped like diamonds, bag? Minecraft diamonds. Set your spawn point on the left side, boy. And Kyle, we're gonna it. commit combat. I'll set it there. Get down here, you two. Unless you're not. Uh, what? Uh, what are we doing? Get over here, Caitlin. We're, we're fighting, fighting a crab. We're fighting. Get ready for the best music in this oh, game. Okay, ju okay, just a moment. I'm just kidding. It's not the best music. Get ready for some good music. My right boy. Sure. I've never heard it before, so I don't know what it's like. What am I? What am I good at fighting? Uh, a lot of projectiles, and it's oh, climbing wow. into the floor a lot. I all right, right, I'm, all right, I'm here. All right, you guys ready? Yeah. Uh, I guess I'm ready. I'll back. All right, three, three, three. Now this is good yeah, music. Twenty-three goes into hell. Oh, oh wow. wow! That is a crap. I thought it was a brain. Well, it, it Watch looks out like for a the brain. spores. They will still hang around and you will be able to touch them and get hurt. There are real crabs that have hair on them. Uh, um, the gloomy maze, uh, maze is literally just watching us. Yeah, he's helping. He's helping us play. I'm surprised it didn't hit me. I'm surprised it didn't hit me. Watch out, that's a spike attack. It also causes walls to stay there for a short bit. Oh, watch out, from the top. Oh yeah, adrenaline boys. Adrenaline and rage. I forgot about adrenaline. I probably could have used adrenaline earlier, but uh, I wasn't thinking about it and then I got hit. Whoa. Oh. Watch out for his climb and watch out for the spores in the top. They'll always leave a semi-open area. Ow. Not very poggers. This boss I'm was dead. easier than the last. We got to do this on normally supposed to be some spores that fall from the sky. Slowly. And they kind of foam in on people. There were... I did experience a few of those earlier. Oh, oh there's one right now. I think they can also just be broken too. Oh! My... I'm irradiating them. My... Uh, That's why I want to kill You know, like you that attack. Nice. He did. Hey, who wants to read the lore item? I shall. A lore item. Crabulon. Fungus and a sea crab. One sought a host, the other a new home. These mushrooms possess a disturbing amount of tenacity. Nothing that lays down to die in their domain is left to rest. It is this sort of ghastly, forceful exertion of control over the unwilling that led me down my path. Alright, I got a rogue weapon. I have a summon weapon. I got a rogue weapon as well. And I have a mushroom plasma root that increases your range mode by one second. Nice. Yeah, everybody use the, the thing that increases your rage. Oh, thank you. Cool. Well, boy. Here you go, here's the rogue weapon. Oh, thank Can I get you. that summon weapon? 
Uh, yes, one second. Gimme, gimme. Gimme. I have a magic weapon, if anyone wants it. I don't think anyone here is magic, sadly. Wait, where's the summon weapon? Okay. I gave it to you. Oh, this is just an accessory. <laughs> I have a summon minion guy. Okay. He wants it. Like a weapon. What is it called? It's a minion. It's a puff shroom. Oh, that's the one I want. Yeah. Oh, I want someone well, still. My spawn's still down. <laughs> um. Well, if it does have other weapons for other people, can we try to fight him again? Yeah, we can. It should have a couple. Yeah, weapons. sure. Huge My inventory is full, though. Um, I'm gonna want to go to the surface. Do any of you have a recall potion on you by any chance? Uh, if you recall, it's just gonna go back to the bed right there, so it makes you un unset it. Yeah, good idea. I, I need to get rid of my monitor. Uh, yeah, I have a recall potion, but... I can just wormhole back down here. I don't know how good these mushroom warriors are, but I guess I should find out. Would you like to bounce around? Our next bosses, by the way, are the Vagrant of Space, a Stars Above boss, and the Eater of Worlds. The easiest way to make an Eater of Worlds arena is take some bombs and some friends and go blow up the entire group. <laughs> and then place some platforms across it. Oh, why'd you kill him? I was trying to test something. Oh, should have said that. <laughs> oh, I need an enemy that isn't gonna die like that. I need an enemy with health. Gosh, dang it. I'm not sure if I like these guys either. I feel less damaged. I'm already not used to this. I'm gonna be right back. You guys can just like fight it without me. Okay. Alright. It will technically be slightly harder, but I will. I think you could um I think you could do it without my um eleven damage per second. <laughs> eleven damage per second is not that bad. Oh yes, 150th cave slot. I mean that cave bat, I don't know why I said cave slime. Alright, well I guess I think we are all here now. It's fighting up a second time then. I wanted to. I want to see whatever, what the melee weapon is. I want to get it. Okay. Are you there, Andy? Yeah, I'm here. Alright. The people Please who are going to be here are here. Okay. <laughs> He's on the right. Oh boy! He's coming! This boy's not having a good time. Oh my gosh. I forgot about that thing. Aw oh, man. I had adrenaline for about 0.5 seconds. <laughs> and I lost it immediately. Why am I getting ping pong right now? Ow. I feel like I'm playing the game of Isaac. <laughs> Just memorizing the patterns and dodging it. I've almost got him. I'm gonna stand here. Woo! Cool. Or oh, well. I think I liked the Desert Scourge's music. I got two rogue weapons! Well, today's my lucky uh, game. Yeah, I got another. I got the rogue weapon again. Uh, <laughs> let me make sure real quick. <laughs> what does Crabulon drop? Yeah, so he I just five. right clicked um, the bag and I got nothing. I don't know if that's a glitch. Oh, I picked not. up your stuff. I guess you're standing right on top of me. Oh, okay. Do you want your stuff? Come here. I had a bag, I right clicked it. Yeah, I picked up your stuff. Because you walked over me. I see. Uh, uh, who is a rogue? Who is rogue? The oh, cloud guy right here. Tyler, uh, Blair did get your melee weapon. 
Oh, or I guess I Kayla, think I, I, Yeah, I think oh, I right. have we your melee weapon. Yep, true melee weapon for you. I guess that really you? depends on if either one of you are going to use it, though. Oh, wait. Oh, I... Here you go. Oh, uh, I, and I did get it. I didn't notice. Rogue. No one else is a rogue. Uh, who hasn't gotten the fungicide item yet? It's the equipable thing that summons, uh... Uh, thingy and it, uh, freaking, uh, the, the fungal clump. Oh, yeah, fungal clump, that's it. Everybody gets that one, it's the guaranteed item. Ah, uh, alright. Uh, when you said fungicide, I thought you meant the gun, in which case that'd be for your melee. Oh, yeah, that's, oh, yeah, Let's that's go what again. I was reading. Yeah, uh, fungicide is a ranged weapon, I believe. Uh, yeah, that's, yeah, is anyone ranged? Yeah, Lee is. Person who's AFK upstairs. Alright, well, I'm good. I got I got the melee weapon. So, who, who is next on the list? Um, it'd be a boss from Starts Book. The Vagrant of Space and Time. I am assuming it's gonna be up in outer space. I have no idea. Never fought him before. That would be interesting because there's very low gravity the higher you go up. Fighting a boss is such Maybe a. Maybe you can just fight him anyway. We have so many desert battalions. <laughs> I do actually. I do need pearl shards. That is from the desert carrier. Yeah. Because I. I mean, I I want to make the uh, the star fury. But uh, we're out of we're out of pearl shards unless someone has some somewhere. How many do you need? Three? I just need two more. Oh, uh, we can just go fight them. We can't do this well. We can probably do them. Three of them. Four mana. All right then. If you're, I'll meet you at the right desert. Fine with that. Oh my, desert scourge is a relatively easy boss. Question mark. What the. Unless someone else put this in Lee's chest. Lee had the uh, melee weapon from Crabulum. Well. <laughs> oh, Lee has a bunch of pearl shards. Okay. Okay, just... never mind. Oh, we have so many desert battalions. <laughs> They're not consumable either. I know. <laughs> Is there anything cool at any of the other pylons? Any cool sales? Oh, that person's selling a cutlass. Oh yeah, so Blair, the, um, the, the Kerbo crafting item is five wood and three stars at a workbench. Stars, okay. Um, I think we have plenty of those in one of these chests, actually. How do you get multiple of them at once? Uh, you can upgrade the item. Uh, if you just put the cross in like the guide or in the magic or in the recipe browser, you can check it. Check it. <laughs> true, true, check it. Check it, check it. Bop it, the star. Midas, you got anything cool? What do He's selling fries. He's also selling shrimp po bay. Oh, there it goes. So we need two stars, you say? Need three stars to make that. Okay, three. well, there. I only found one in the chests. I guess I'll take it. Uh, oh, I, I um, I had all the stars in my inventory because I was crafting something. Oh, okay. Let's um, get water real quick. So since the nurse is really useless, we could put the arms dealer in the desert along with the nurse, and then we can keep the die trader here, the guide in the. The guy didn't fit. Can I move people around? Sure. For optimal pricing. For specific characters, that is. We're gonna go to the jungle. We're gonna move the demolitionist, because you're a nerd, you don't belong here, and keep the painter there. We're gonna go to the ocean pylon. We're gonna put the angler here and get rid of the merchant. The golfer also needs to leave the ocean by that number. I don't think we have anybody else who likes this area. So for now, I'll just uh, keep them there. We can go to the ice biome. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have anybody to put in the ice biome. 
yet. Where's the merchant? You go there. I don't know if you can see who's I'm not assigned a house right now. Demolitionists need to house underground, but do that later. Probably somewhere near the bottom of the elevator. Yeah, put him in the underworld. Like what yeah. I always do. Said near, not in. Alright, I'm not a monster. Yet. What is that you're seeing? It's the weapon That's the from Crabular. Yeah. Um, so oh, I guess. Oh, you said you had stars, or did you use them? I put them back in the crafting chest. You um, don't mind by... if I take two more, do you? Yeah, you can take stuff. By the way, do we, uh. 91? Jeez. That's a lot. Do we know when Lee's gonna come back so we can do the, uh. Next boss fight? I don't know. I don't know what Lee went to do. <laughs> Went to get food and then never Is came it back. Star I cross know. that I want to craft. Yeah. Yes. Oh yeah, it looks like it. I need to craft. Can you craft two of those? Um, um, give me one. Yes, I will grab the stuff and craft you one while I'm in. I was. I thought you were like had the stuff on still, so I was like. I just grabbed the, um like a specific amount. Okay, wow. I have one. Where are you? Bye. I see the star cross for later. Thank you. But now he can be out as a I'm just gonna use, I'm gonna use him now. And I'll put the full moon squeaky toy back. I like it. It actually sounds like Kirby. I can craft a goblin army summon. It would be nice to have the goblin tinkerer. Oh, what was the name again of the next boss you were talking about? Yes. I would like Oh that. yeah, it would be nice to get rocket boots. We should see if we can manually summon the goblin army, if possible. Yeah, I just crapped the thing. Um, should I use it right now? Or, like, do you think we have enough time it to- It is in the middle of the day, would it, it matter if we it doesn't it matter. Okay, doesn't matter, it yeah, doesn't matter. Okay. I'm up to no. fight the army. Invasions, invasions happen no matter what time. Most of the time, okay. unless there's pets about. goblin armies only <laughs> approach during the day. Well, no, I that's do. it, it naturally happens. I do know they- uh, I do know they trigger at the beginning of the day. They have never in my life triggered during the day. Yeah, it's oh. just because that's how events are set up to activate. If you just spawn them in, they don't care about the time. They'll just come. Alright. Alright, All right. right, then we're fighting the army. Which side is it coming from? The west. west. Um, is that my left or my right? Left. Left. Alrighty. Oh my gosh. I don't know why this happens. The axe of regrowth and the staff of regrowth. Hey, hey the mushroom biome appeared. I just oh, got gosh. the... Or not the way I wanted it to look. Like, I wanted mushroom trees as well. Oh, I'm being attacked by an army. I need backup. I need backup, guys. Oh no! <laughs> Lee's getting murdered. Well, guess he shouldn't have been eating for so long. I don't even know what this is. I don't know what he's actually doing. I just said food. Does so it make sense? Yeah. Oh, this is what I call a tower defense. Oh, they're spawning Look in there. all the turbos. <laughs> There's so much turbos. I just got a taboo plasma bomb. I got this. It's a magic weapon. I hate how these things spawn in me. Okay. They did are it. dead. Now I just need to find the zombie tinker. Yeah, if I recall, he's on the cavern layer underground and he just spawns randomly. Yeah. Yep. That's correct. 
Oh. Well, good thing I remembered that. Someone does their homework. I'm jumping into the caves. Alright, well, I will go down there and look for him. You guys are more than welcome to join me if you want. I want rocket boots really bad. You know what's good about the life form analyzer? Yes. Is that you can see the goblin tinker. Yeah. Indeed. The cell phone is pretty nice to have too, because you can literally see everything. Too much information from the cell phone. I know. I like it. I like some of the info. I like all of it. Even what moon phase it is. Speed of the wind. Yeah. yeah okay, like, speed of the wind is kind of useful though. You can like, disable how much it shows. If, uh, I know. You know. Who cares about the moon phases, you know? It's good for fishing. True. I forgot about that. Found goblin near me, boss. He's around here somewhere. Wait, he's really like, right around here. Where is he? Oh, there he is. <laughs> he's on the real mine. He's on the real cart. Alright, I bought a Tinker's workshop and I bought myself rocket boots. <laughs> Alright. I don't need to I do to have the buy. Tinker. Alright, then I'll buy myself um, a pair of rocket boots. Um, do you, whoever's up there, I'm willing to buy rocket boots for you so you don't have to make the trip. Who wants some? I'm not, uh, I'm not poor. You don't need to do it for me. I'll just teleport him up here once you guys are done with him. Okay. Just replace the demolition Or replace somebody in the snow biome because he likes the snow. Plus, prices are always better for the, for the goblin tinker. <laughs> the most expensive person to have in this game. He likes the snow? I didn't know that. Now all I need to do is yep. find Hermes boots. You can craft them. Oh, that's right! Okay, um... I don't even know where to start for that recipe. I think it's like cloth and swiftness potions. Makes sense. I need to go find an ankle. Okay. In I will go and grab some of those potions or stuff. Let's see. If I even want to make anklets of the wind, I'll make jungle spores. So the jungle, here I come. Yeah, I, I need to get spores too. I. Yeah. Can't make that. Can't make that. And I can't make that either. I can't do this. No. Clouds. I need to get clouds for that. that? Okay, well, I guess that. I'm sticking with the normal rocket boots for now. Yeah, I'm here for a good old aglet of the wind. Yeah, me too. Oh, I, I, did, I did keep that uh, that crafting recipe in mind, but then I had to use the sports for something else. Well, what could this something else be, Tyler? Duh, I don't remember. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> it was something important, though. And I got my lucky horseshoe. I'm ready to fur light. Hey, it's lantern night. Yep. yep. Happened the entire nice. boss fight has been killed during the event has been made. Yeah, after ah. after any that you do for the first time. Yeah. Okay, so okay. it's just people in the world um celebrating your success. Yes. Yeah, pretty much. Do you, need, do you need an anklet, you say? An anklet, yes. Yep. Nice. I don't remember where you get that. It's from the jungle, typically, but we can just craft it in this case. Okay. Trust me, I know all my well, most of my spawns. The specific items. There's so much stuff in this game. I can I can't remember most. Do you find any sky islands? I think some people have. Um, I don't know where they are. Whatever, no need to tell on that not so fun fact. It's dead. Good job on that, by the way. Hey, Andy, I have a small request. I would like, I would like to read dialogue for myself, if that's all right. My bad. From the center you would match with it. <laughs> Thank you. It just, yeah, I, I just want to uh, experience it for myself whenever, whenever I get around to it. 
It's not that I don't like your voice. <laughs> you already knew that. Whoa. Oh, man eater. I love the jungle. Underground jungle is so easy to survive in. Ow, what just hit me? Oh, you... It's like, take that back right now. <laughs> oh, and it got mad. So mad, in fact, that he flew at me at lightning speeds. I didn't know they could fly that fast. Oh, many turbos. I like it. Traveling merchant has arrived. I pr probably have a good enough amount of spores. Do you need more spores, Andy, or did you already no, get enough? I got it. Okay. Collecting clouds for the boys. How many clouds right. do I need for it? I think... Uh, 15. So if you could get a good amount. Yeah, thank you. I wish I had a fast rate of mine clouds. I'm literally crying. Where'd Lee go? <laughs> I don't so know. Cute. Oh, um, do you have Torch God's favor by any chance? Or an arena? What? Nobody. I don't think you've done Torch God. Because Torch Luck is kind of nice to find. I, I have I. That's something I can set up in a bit. Let me see. I'm gonna go yeah, back to the. Can not we just? Yeah. Are we able to just make it right here if we wanted to? I mean, it's um, open no way in heck. Here. No way in heck am I making it in the jungle, on the underground jungle. Okay. Just a suggestion. It's it. There are way too many enemies. I mean, no, no, not that it's that. Bad. I mean, like I said, underground jungle isn't that Whoa. hard. Hey, cloud, get your head out of the clouds. Uh -huh. <laughs> Alright, I got like 300 clouds, that should be enough. Any Shen Hannigans? Yeah, very good. Now watch, as I turn six, that's right, six accessories into one, into two. Bam. 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 Three slot. Not acquired because I figured I have to put on the shield to do. But I did free up some space. Now I don't need to worry about falling speed and all that crap. Tyler, here's the clouds. I put everything else away in chests. So. Nice thing. Let's see, now what do I need? Ah, uh, ice skates. Yeah, we need ice skates for frost spark boots. I never have good luck finding ice skates. <laughs> I feel like I either find them or I just never get them. Then yeah. I have to like figure it out, you know? Yeah. But Whoa. we could just craft them too. I, 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 oh, you I can. like I'm this boathouse that whoever made this. I'm going oh, to snow biome. Oh, ice machine. Yeah, I haven't, haven't found that either. Whoever made this boathouse, I really like it. Oh, thank you. I did want to add a lot more to it, um, but I haven't had time to. Somebody came down here and like placed two torches and didn't place any more. <laughs> here, let me just do this. Please. Hello. Alright. I fell too far. What is that noise? Uh, well, to me it sounded like a Discord thing, so I'll need to check it. There we go. I will. I guess luck doesn't really help us right now, but... Yeah. Luck does not affect chests, unfortunately. But it affects NPCs. There we go. Yep. Which, I, I don't know how useful that is. <laughs> it's useful, it's pretty useful. I mean, in terms of what items are down in the ice barn. Yeah. Gosh, thanks, slush. Uh oh. He's dead. <laughs> the, the slush got into his computer. So, what are you guys doing? Like, what's the plan? Are we gonna go fight a boss? Are we just doing our separate things or what? Uh, me and Andy, before Andy got disconnected, um, we're hello. looking for a. Is that you, Andy? Yeah. Oh, hello. hello. Uh, me and Andy, we're looking for a, a, an ice machine. Yes. Uh, yeah, nice so that's in the s uh, not that. 
I think those are located in the underground. Yep, Stop. underground. Underground snow. That's where we are right now. Okay. What's up, bro? No, yes. I stayed down here for you. I believe you. Keep an eye out for ice skates while, you're there, while we're down here, too. It's actually why we're looking for the ice machine, because you can craft ice skates with it. Just repeating. Finding the ice skates themselves would be unideal, because uh, it would only be for one person. Hey, look, a nice chest. It's got an ice machine. Victory oh, acquired. Nice, okay. No, we just need leather. How do we get leather again? Uh, we need leather, iron, and ice blocks. Leather can be acquired from a couple of enemies, or we can craft it. Yeah, I, I can't remember how you craft it. Um, we need to go hunt in the corruption. We need rotten chunks. Oh, right. I remember now. Whoa, that's I a big... That is a big animal. The Rhinehound. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, Rhinehounds also drop uh, leather. Shouldn't kill them. Oh, and I got leather, yeah. I'll go to the corruption and start burning. Oh, wait. Um, the crimson vertebrae is what uh, replaced uh, the leather, right? Vertebrae no. replaces rotten chunks. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, leather's made from rotten chunks. That's right. There you go. Mushrooms. You guys want some? I'm good. I'll just shove them in your potion tonight. It's where right. I'm gonna. Tyler, can you get a bunch of ice blocks? Oh, yes, I can do that. Oh. I just need to go back there. I teleported back to the house. Uh, oh, I don't have a wiring chest. I thought I did. Oh, I do. There, just finally. Let's see how many? Actually, I guess I, I can just check. Twenty. Okay. So I will get like a hundred. In fact, I'll get 500. Alright. A good enough ice box have been acquired. For some reason, it doesn't work to harvest a blink root with the axe of regrowth. I'm not sure why. Oh right, corruption. I forgot. Hi. Hello. It is getting close to 10 here for me. I will say that now before I get distracted. If you guys have something grand you want me to be a part of, Monster Slaying, now is the time. Well, there's a boss we could do right now. Well, he is, so... Uh, yeah, <laughs> Lee still isn't even here, I don't think, right? Not that I know. No, not that I know. No, yeah, yeah Lee's not here, Rhett. You're not here. Yeah, her, her character is still standing in the same Torch, tor torch luck should be beneficial in this case. Hello. Hey. Uh, Lee, while you were gone, we did a goblin army. Yeah, I asked Caitlyn if you guys did anything. Oh my god. Right. Like, I would have felt bad if you guys were like waiting for me to do a boss or something. Like, I wouldn't want you to wait for me. What a coincidence. Do it. We happen to have a boss to ready <laughs> to fight. Uh... Just kind of sitting in my You guys probably have to spawn too. Um, okay. Well, if you are ready to fight a boss, I could um, go over there. Um, yeah, the vagrant of something, want, right? Um, yeah, the vagrant of space. Quiet time here shortly before I go to bed. So, for, so after this boss, we fight it a couple of times. I think I might go tonight. Alright. I guess we should... Is there anything we should know before we do it, Andy? Or do we just no kind of do it? I right. have no idea about this boss. I know Calamity bosses, not so there's a both ones, though. Well, alright then. 
I do like how the mod has some great uses for certain items. Yeah. Alright, who put the golden squirrel in the consumables chest? <laughs> in the food chest? That's its fate, isn't it? Okay, I'm back. Uh, I mean, yeah, eventually. <laughs> Maybe not. Right. Uh, My character is practically invisible. Yeah, see yeah. how it goes. Yeah. Um, alright, well. I'm ready for whatever this is gonna be. Oh, I put more battle potions in the chest, guys. Or I refreshed, okay. or not refreshed, I replenished some swiftness, iron skin, or generation. Okay, I, I, only, I only need a few, Zale, is all. I'm waiting. I'll take um, two iron skin and two regen, and I'll call it. Oh, uh, do we? Hold on. And I'll take Let's one see. swiftness just for luck. Can I make a. Yeah, here we go. This. That right there. I forgot if I need I need glass. I almost forgot about ale. There we go. I got some ale for the fight. For for I'm assuming is a fight. Ah. Uh, I think it gives you a. I can't remember if it's a debuff or if it was a buff and a debuff. It's a buff and a debuff. Makes sense. Increases melee damage and reduces my defense. Alright, I'm gonna spawn him. Okay. Alright, well, I don't know who, who to expect or what we're fighting. Look out for his sword. Ow! Oh. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, oh it's, it's a, 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 it a oh. person. Okay. I don't even know if he's difficult to use. He oh, he, he is him. dying really fast. He doesn't have that much time. What a loser. Kill him. Kill him spot. That oh, was he has more phases, oh. I think. I was yeah, just gonna yeah. say, that was laughably easy. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, no, he's dead. Oh, he is dead. Okay. okay. <laughs> His health jumped up, so I thought he was gonna do something. I know, I saw a bar appear at the bottom, too. Alright, well, we fought him a bit late. <laughs> that was. Uh... No, we, we, that was, we were supposed to fight him right there. I don't think his health scaled. <laughs> oh. I picked up some stellar remnant and enigmatic dust. Those are materials. Yeah, I, I got yeah. stellar I'm remnant. assuming the spatial prism is also a everyone thing. Yeah, I got, I got a spatial prism as well. I don't know what any of this stuff is for. I You're don't like either. a zombie slayer, aren't you? Shepherd's, Shepherd's Sunstone teleports all distant players to multiplayer to your position. Huh. Dude. Weird. How about the like oh, sounds like an admin summon. item. Bro, I just got a vanity set and like two remnant cellar remnants and like that's it. <laughs> got some dust. Yeah, we all got we all got enigmatic dust and stellar remnant and the spatial prison. Alright, well um, I, don't I think I'm gonna prison. go and get some quiet time to get ready for bed. Alrighty then. Oh um well, you had fun. Definitely some new stuff and a lot of new stuff to explore and find here. I'm looking forward to it. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye. Stars Above does have multiplayer settings. So. Yeah. I would assume it's at least playable enough in multiplayer. So. Yeah. Yeah, I just don't think we get to see any of the cool worlds that they've made. Because. Multi world library, sub world library, just working multiplayer. Okay, so that just happened. Now that I've got a better look at the corpse of this mushroom crab thing, the truth is revealed and it's not pretty. It looks like the fungus have reanimated the crab's corpse and paraded it around like a marionette. That's disgusting. Whatever, no need to dwaddle on that. Not so fun fact. It's dead. Good job on that, by the way. Oh, she was talking about crab on there. Oh, I see. Please, please excuse my test. I know it was crude, but it's the only way I know how to judge someone. In reality, I should have known. My sisters would never choose unwisely. Huh? Sister? No way. Oh, I apologize, Asudin. This should help. Ring any bells? Dude, we've got to stop meeting like this. The nerve. Please, let me explain, Starbear. In tandem with our galaxy's myriad worlds, there exist starfarers to aid their denizens who are familiar with what we do. 
As we are conduits of energy, we choose a star bearer to act as our envoy. You should know that living beings are the best conductors of mana, and we're only partially alive. However, the first starfarer's nominee was unfitting for their role. This is the first star bearer. From what I know, they seem to have lost their mind and morals. Now they continue to roam the galaxy. The starfarer are thralled to their chosen one's whims. They pursue good through any means necessary. <laughs> Often with casualties. This is all conjecture, but the distraction is very real. It should go unsaid that we can't let this continue. I'll need your help in the future. As it stands now, you have little chance of besting them. However, while Asphodine doesn't know it, all Starfarers have an ace up their sleeve, the Stellar Nova. I have bequeathed the power to her the second you won our duel. This is a, that is all for now. I must continue to track the first Starfarer. Good luck, I will have need of you soon. I know he's a loner, but I wish we could have spoken more. Stay safe, Perseus. I can't help but feel he's hiding something from me, though. Just me. Anyway, he was right. I do feel stronger. My hair has gotten all shiny. <laughs> this power should be an amazing boon going forward. Looks like my stellar nova is called Prototokia Aster. Perhaps we'll get to use some more once we defeat more powerful foes. After binding the Stellar Nova key, you should be able to equip the Stellar Nova to the Spatial Disc like usual. You should have some prismatic cores already. With their power, I theorize you can upgrade Stellar Novas with crafting. This is important. You need Stellar Nova energy to cast Novas. You gain Nova energy in combat, and it depletes outside of combat. Okay, a lot has happened, but this is a huge step forward for us. Please use the Novas well. Bye for now. So this... Uh, I'll miss with that later. Did I by any chance get anything from Krabby Bomb? Nope. Okay, I am back. I was reading a lot of things. Yeah. So, uh, did, you, did you already read how the stealth methods work, or do you need to explain it? Um, I didn't actually look at the menu yet, but I did read everything she said. Where's the animal for Tesla? Come here. <laughs> okay. Alright. I don't think I even hit most of those. Oh, there's a ninja in there now. Hey, we can't see him in the first time. He was slacking on the dome. Oh, hello, the ninja. Ah! Swan. Hey, what did I just get? Wand of Technology summons a wall placer at your cursor. Oh wait, those things. That's my head up here. Oh wait, I'm running out of combat power. I wanna, I wanna redo it. I wanna do it again. I need to go down to hell. Oh, I'm losing it so fast. I wanna see the, I wanna see the skill again. Please. I beg. Any enemy. Ah uh, yeah. So sorry for me vanishing for a bit while I listened or while I read. The Starfarer stuff is. Does anyone, does everyone know about the uh, spatial disk upgrade thing? I do. No. What is no? What? what? Uh. Well, that person we just fought was testing us. Apparently, you'll know more if you use the spatial disk. Why are there voodoo demons showing up already, dude? They know you want to trigger the hard mode already. I mean, kind of. <laughs> but it's got nothing to do with them. They should mind their own business. Business. Top 10 people who should mind their own business. These demons should mind their own business. If they mind their own business, then they can make their own money. I want to see that ability again. I wonder what, um... The other one's ability is Stella Nova ready. All right, now I can just take a look at. It. Oh. Oh wait, you can cast it separately. That's so cool. Our next boss, when we get, uh, I guess next Sunday, would be Eater of Worlds. Yeah. All right, I'm done for now. So goodbye. All right, goodbye. Okay. Oh, finally, do you have to go to sleep, or what's what's going on? 
Oh, uh, I'll hang out for a bit while I figure things out with the spatial disk. Did you did you say you like charge it by doing damage or something? So you have to be in a, a constant fight pretty much to charge it. Okay. It doesn't charge otherwise. It actually uncharges if you're not in a fight. Okay. And that spatial prism that you got can be applied to the ability itself in the spatial disc. Yeah, okay, yeah, I just put that on. Yeah, I'll, I'll see what class I continue being. I I am already slightly missing summoner, but that might just be because I don't know. Only slightly. I, it's just uh it's just fear of changing. That's really all that is to it. Oh, I didn't realize you left. I am in here alone now. <laughs> I'll show you what I can really do. Okay. Stellar or the Nova thing is interesting. Did not expect her to actually talk. Whoa, hey, Bone Serpent. How you doing? Nice to meet you. What the heck is that? Prismatic Core. Old Lord Claymore. That's really cool. I like that. Are you still there, Andrew? Hello. Yes. Hello. I really like all the crafting recipes I've added. It looks like I'm going to be able to make a f final vanilla Terraria boot upgrade because of these new crafting recipes. Plus sparks. It makes me happy. Yeah, I'm happy you can craft the lava charm. <laughs> Yeah. I think that and the ice skates, I think, take me the longest to find for the boots. Oh, I have the lava parts. I just yeah. forgot to make the obsidian waders. Whatever they're called. Yeah, I just, uh, I just got the, uh, the stuff to make it. Alright, last thing I need is the obsidian rose. Sadly, its crafting option is not something I can do right now. Which means my only option is killing imps, but I don't think I'm gonna do that right now. Or just simply, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that right now because I gotta go to sleep. While I was in the underworld for just a few, just like a few minutes testing out the uh, Stellar Nova, the a Bone Serpent dropped a really neat weapon for me. Oh, the, uh, uh, the old Lord Claymore. Yeah. And I really like it. Oh, it's so hard to- that's a bomb! Alright, I'm either going to be perfectly safe doing this or die instantly. You cancer! You have cancer! You are cancer! I'm dead. They don't want to live in this core. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I panic rig. <laughs> Meteor bomb. So that's what? what happens if you talk to the nurse. Wait, just talking to her? Yeah, I was just gonna see what she would say. And I exploded. She didn't want to live in this world. Honestly, I don't blame her. But did she, did she really have to try taking me with her? I will finally turn off the screen. <laughs> Thank you for hanging out again. Uh, I am I am enjoying this. Okay. Yeah, tomorrow will be and it'll be nice. It's normally it, it used to be my horrible day because I would be at school for almost the entire first half of the day and then go to work. But now I don't have work after after uh, after so school. What I'm hearing um, is two player game of death mode, master mode calamity, right? <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> right? <laughs> you know, you know. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> you know, the mode that Revengeance says, or not Revengeance, the mode that Infernum says is easier than Inferno. <laughs> no, it's alright, we can get the Infernum patch for Master Mode. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I, I actually don't know if there's a Master Mode Infernum patch. I think there is. 
but <laughs> oh yep, I see it. Master and legendary mode. Excuse patches. me, legendary mode. <laughs> Tyler, you know what we gotta do? It's the a two player <laughs> game of ultimate extreme chaos and doom. On the uh, Zenith yeah, save. On the Zenith save. <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> Is that is the Xena save the one oh, wow. where you start down in hell? It's the one that has like a but like a, almost all of the secret oh, seeds. Oh yeah, that one. Uh, mixed What's in. What's the one where you start? Reversed? I was playing it myself. Uh, that one is. Yeah, we can do that one on that save. I don't remember what it's called. <laughs> where lava pops out of dirt or whatever. <laughs> out of uh, the crispy honey yeah, blocks, which are plentiful in the underground on that on that seed true evil made it when i was doing that on vanilla um it, it made it so painful making a elevator i kept needing to make shafts to funnel all this lava into and sometimes i would forget about it and accidentally let lava into my base <laughs> <laughs> so, so yeah I don't I think I I can't remember if I defeated any bosses on it. I think I didn't. It's so I think it just took I think I defeated maybe one. Can't remember which one though. <clears throat> maybe the Eye of Cthulhu cuz I really wanted the shield. But I mean, if you ever do want to do a two player different hard mode of calamity. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't mind trying it with you. <laughs> it would give us something to do uh outside of playing with yeah, everyone this one, this one only um, happens twice a week yeah yeah if i'm not busy on tuesdays i mean i uh did have some homework that probably would have been smart to do today but i wasn't feeling it <laughs> so. as long as it doesn't like destroy you you know yeah hopefully it doesn't <laughs> turns out this is the most important um, thing he needed to do <laughs> Well, that's fine. I know what's I know what's due and what isn't due. Um, and uh, physics is already late, so you know. <laughs> oh, no. Not the physics, dude. Yeah, my hardest class. Yeah, this is my third class with the same teacher. He grades his homework super late, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Just as long as I eventually do. Josh it. is a a physics nerd, that's but I cool. also don't remember when he last took it. So been a while yeah I, I i actually do like some a lot of the things that you learn in physics it's just so difficult to uh or I, I i think i've said it before like i just don't feel like we practice enough in class we learn the bare minimum and then the practice is left to us i'm gonna figure out what this legendary mode is inferno master and legendary mode patches you imagine a master mode for the worthy Inferno run? That'd be terrifying. That'd be <laughs> the worst. <laughs> that would be terrible. I mean, if you want to try it someday, we can. Ah, uh, yes. I choose not playing the game, please. <laughs> I'd like to play the game, but also not be allowed to. Yeah. Oh man, the person that made the patch, they have like almost my exact same yeah, name. Zeal. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't notice that. <laughs> Crazy. It's my long lost twin brother slash sister. Yeah, um, we couldn't use Catalyst because I don't think it was working <laughs> at the time. I don't know if they patched it or not though. I remember saying that the Whips mod was going to be integrated into Catalyst. And I was thinking of adding it, even though I don't really know what kind of stuff it adds. But then I, but then I saw that it said it tended to be used in brand new playthroughs, so I was afraid of turning it on because we had already, I had already made our world and we had already started it a little what bit. I know it doesn't matter as long as you haven't gotten past a certain point. Oh, that would. The Zenith Seed is kind of is pretty. There are some neat things about it though that I never got to experience because I lost oh. interest in my. Because actually, when I was doing it alone, um, I was ac I was actually trying to give myself an extra challenge. Oh. <laughs> um, I can't remember what it was. I think I was trying to be a true summoner. Not the not the challenge on like, top of the challenge, man. <laughs> 
I think it's because I wanted to record something neat that hasn't been done yet. Um, but I got really bored. Mm-hmm. Um, but I, there is a unique boss to the Zenith save or Zenith secret seed. All I I won't say too much about it if you don't already if you don't know about it. It is a hard mode boss, and it, I, yeah, I'll, I'll, I just won't say much more about it because I feel like I, I do have things I could try to say about it, but I feel like it'll give it away. So it's a boss that I think I would have I think I would have both loved and would have been terrified uh, to have experienced a blind. <laughs> But I know about it because I accidentally like read it at some point. It's probably something weird like Negrom or something. I don't know. Like what? I don't know. That one that one boss that's not in PC version. Just in one of the other versions. Or it's the Dungeon Guardian. I don't know. <laughs> um, anyways, no, it, it's a it's a unique boss to the Xena save. It's it's not from it's not from other exclusive Terraria versions. <laughs> the tooltip to summon it. It ju- the tooltip says you really shouldn't. Cool. <laughs> Too bad it's a boss you have to fight. <laughs> I will say that it's an essential boss. You can't continue in hard mode without defeating it. Well, it only narrows down the areas of where it could be. If it's early, then it's one of the mech bosses. If it's late, then it's like I don't know, golem or some weird thing. In that area, the jungle. I feel like the jungle and then like mech bosses are like the main hard mode bosses besides like uh Windlord. <laughs> also I feel like we're having an easy time in um in Infernum and that's purely because I think we're just spawn cheesing him. <laughs> then again, these are also the earlier bosses, so who knows? I can nerf our boss respawning. <laughs> Anyways, I guess I will go now. Thank you again for playing. Okay. I will see you later. All right. See you, man. Good night.